teleschool.com learn tele for free hello guys rishit cha from teleschool.com once again today we are going to see the second part of the stock market video now today i'm going to tell you how to pass entries when you invest in stock market instead of trading so it is your investment whether short term or long term today we will see it how to pass entries for investment so first of all as it is an investment we don't want it in our profit and loss account because that's where the trading comes trading of stock market and their entries will come in profit and loss but investment it will only be reflected in the balance sheet therefore we will separate the balance sheet and profit and loss account in terms of stock for that we have to do one step one simple step go to configure sorry go to features or press f11 go to accounting features and in general option there is an option called integrate accounts and inventory just press no i have already done it no in, in your by default it will be yes so please press no this will not merge accounts and inventory okay and press control plus a so we have done it come out at the gateway of tally now we will pass entries for passing entries we have to create some ledgers so we will first create share broker ledger then we will create share investment group under which all our shares will be reflected and then we will create a share ledger share name ledger for example for passing entry so first of all we will create a share broker ledger so go to accounts info go to ledgers and create so share broker okay now keep it in sundry datas or creditors as per your wish and maintain bill by bill no inventory values affected no go ahead and enter all the details i am not entering here okay if you have the details enter here and create now we will create a group group creation is also simple from accounts info go to groups and groups and create a single group create a group name investment in shares now i will tell you later why i am creating a group in this video okay investment in shares okay seems like i have already created the group so you can create a group like this and you have to create it under investments okay so now i have created a group also and create a ledger named reliance for the stock ledger that's what i have called earlier so go to accounts info go to ledgers and create a single ledger named reliance for passing a stock market entry here and it will be created under share investment sorry investment in shares and as you can see investment in shares is further under investments and inventory is values affected yes go ahead and create so i have created three things number 1 share broker ledger number 2 a group named investment in shares under investments and number 3 reliance company ledger that is for stock we are buying shares of that okay so now go to accounting vouchers or simply press v and come in journal by pressing f7 or simply click here i am currently in journal so let me pass the entry let's say we have bought 100 shares of reliance at 10000 rupees and 100 rupees extra is brokerage so in total our bill is 10100 so we will debit what we have bought and here comes inventory locations pass reliance now i have created here a stock item named reliance as you can see i can show you the details here is the stock item i have created a reliance on the primary and units number that is how many numbers of stock shares okay reliance 
let's say I have bought 100 quantity of 10,000 amount as I said earlier okay now to share broker of course because we have to pay share broker 10,000 rupees plus 100 brokerage so here I'll enter 10,100 and automatically our one debit side will open because there's a difference of 100 rupees now there is no share brokerage account so here we can create a share brokerage account by pressing alt c and this window will open here i'll enter share brokerage and as it is our investment it will be reflected under the capital account so type capital and press enter inventory values are affected now go ahead and press enter and create so this ledger share brokerage is created so i have paid in total 10100 for buying 100 shares of reliance go ahead and press enter okay so our entries are done now let me show you the effects in the balance sheet simply press b from the gateway of tally and here is the balance sheet press alt plus f1 to show the detailed view here it is investments now i've created a group earlier there is investment in shares which will be reflected under investments and go ahead and click enter or press enter and you will see reliance debit 10,000 rupees okay because you have bought 10,000 worth of shares it will be reflected in the balance sheet under investments as share brokerage account now capital account is debit so it will it is showing under the assets because i have only a single entry named share brokerage so here it is share brokerage you have to pay that and sundry creditors because in total i have to pay 10100 rupees to the share broker now here's another thing i want to tell when you go in stock summary you can st see the number of quant quantity you have bought the rate at which you have bought and the value now this is the magic of tally now why i have disintegrated accounts and inventory because if i've integrated it will show the inventory in profit and loss account now here there is no inventory in profit and loss account because i have disintegrated accounts and inventory at the first of the video as i shown earlier so guys this was the video for stock market as investment i think this will be a great help for you if you liked it please do share it with your friends please like the facebook page we have gone over 1000 likes in the past few days i am very happy with that please follow me on twitter or please follow tele school on twitter tele school is the twitter id goodbye thank you for watching the video